Hello, welcome to Alabama Live. I'm Jasmine Williams. In just a few minutes, the Alabama Commissioner of Agriculture and Industries will kick off the 21st annual tomato sandwich lunch in Montgomery. WSFA 12 News anchor Sally Pitts is there. Sally, what's going on? Hey, you know, no better way to beat the heat here on a summer day than a tomato sandwich. We're at Ed Teague Arena out here at Garrett Coliseum. I'm joined now by Ag Commissioner Rick Pate. This looks delicious. It's about more than tomatoes, though, really. This is about celebrating Alabama produce and products made right here in the state. Right. We put a lot of emphasis on encouraging people to buy local. It tastes better. It's more nourishing for you, and it helps, obviously, our local farmers. And so we actually have a little farmer's market set up outside if people wanted to come and take some things home with them. But, yeah, we've got Alabama-grown tomatoes, Alabama-grown sweet corn, and all the pro other products up here donated. Golden Flake chips. Bluebell. Yeah, Bud's cookies. They're all out here. So how do you make the perfect tomato well, we're sandwich? That. Let's do it. All right. So you got to start off with white bread. You got wheat bread for people who want it, but we think yeah, you need we white do bread. Yeah, but yeah, and then we're gonna put some mayonnaise on it. Sally says she doesn't especially like mayonnaise, but but I'm gonna do it because you say I need to. You do, and it really takes two. So I'm, I'm making a mess, but I'm gonna do it. <laughs> You're always going to make a mess with yeah. the tomato sandwich, right? All right. We're going to wipe that You used around. a knife. I just used my packet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now we're getting started. We're warming up. All right. So we'll get us the two homegrown, vine ripened. That was so big. I <laughs> that is that a big too. tomato right there. There yeah. we go. Yeah. Which side? All right. Yeah. Perfect. All right. Oh. And then we'll come over here. We're going to skip the bacon bits because we don't know where that came from. So we're not <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna skip the onions. I gotta talk to about three to five hundred people today, and they. I'm gonna take not. the onions. The next person I interview may not appreciate it. All right, and then we we'll get a little lettuce. There you go. All right, perfect. And this is Alabama grown sweet corn, and it'll be delicious. I promise you. I left my salt and pepper down there, but anyway, <laughs> get some golden flake, original. Not gonna get all that other fancy. Get the original potato chip. You don't need the fancy Bud's stuff. cookies are the best. They've been so supportive. Is that Bud? Yep. You went chocolate chip. I'm, I'm going to go, you go with the other one. ones. And we're going to get our Bluebell ice cream now, too. I think life's short and you eat dessert first. What do you say? Well, let me have a Bud. I mean, let me have a Bluebell. Yes, sir. Chocolate uh, vanilla? Chocolate. chocolate. You got chocolate for her and vanilla for me. All right. <laughs> Bluebell. Ice cream, they've been a great supporter always. Every year they show up with this cooler and yeah, it adds to it. So You said everybody to know, donates all these products. Everything other than paper products, yeah. All right, let's try it. All right, here we go. You said we're gonna get messy. Yeah, I brought a napkin. I don't think I brought <laughs> I did. All right, flip that bad boy over. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. Yeah, that's true, you got a handicap. <laughs> So good. Mm. Have a second bite. Is that mm. the perfect sandwich? It is perfect sandwich. It is. It's really delicious. Thank you so much. And we make these at home coming. now. Yes. You know, and again, the go box if you don't have time to sit. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good idea too. You may want two of these. Again, we're out here at Ed Teague Arena. They have a farmers market set up outside as well, where you can buy local honey, local jellies and jams. They have homemade soaps and lotions. They also have the Sweet Grown Alabama food truck out there making fried green tomatoes as well. So there's so much to offer out here at the 21st annual tomato sandwich luncheon. Yeah, Starts I'm officially at 30 minutes from opening. So that's the reason this will be packed. It'll be solid people. Come on out. We're going to send it to First Alert Meteorologist Amanda Kern. Amanda, this is really refreshing on a steamy day like today. Yeah, I'd love it if you could bring me back one without onions, mayo included. That would be great, Sally. Thank you so